What's going on YouTube? Nicholas here with Tech Love TV, where we don't discriminate and we believe all tech, all tech deserves some love. See some love, it's love day. I'm yeah, sure man. people love out here on the court. Today we got some earphones, some workout earphones from a company named Bleak. B-L-I-I-Q, I think it's Bleak. So, if you've been watching any of my latest videos, you would know that when I get a set of headphones, earphones, whatever, whatever kind of tech item that I'm reviewing, I often make a prejudgment, and this might be wrong, I make a prejudgment of the company off of their packaging. And this company right here did a really nice job. They put a lot of detail and effort into this packaging. It's just not just some random box, flimsy, and just thrown in there. And that makes me think that, before I even see the headphones, that the headphones are probably a uh, good quality as well. And that theory has not failed me yet, and we'll see if that theory holds true true with these bleak headphones. So real quick, let me go around this box. You go on the front side, you get the bleak company logo, hummingbird wireless headphones. On the back side, wireless Bluetooth, ultra precise Bluetooth technology delivers seamless transmission and connection with all devices. It doesn't say which version of Bluetooth are in here. Maybe in the user manual it might say that. Ultra long battery life up to 14 and a half hours of uninterrupted music on a full charge quick charge 10 minutes of charging will get you about an hour of playback time sweat proof is it sweat proof or sweat resistant I'm gonna, it says sweat proof on the back of this box, but I think I'm gonna say sweat resistant, water resistant, because when I hear sweat proof or waterproof, I'm thinking that it can be submerged in water. And I'm not gonna submerge these in water just to find out, so I'm gonna go with sweat resistant. But also, this is the interesting part. If you do think that these are sweat proof or waterproof and you do submerge them in water, they do have a warranty. And what type of warranty is this? The judge gave them the long ride, bro. Life, huh? Mm -hmm. Life! Yes, that's right. It's a lifetime warranty, which is amazing to me because a lot of tech items that I've seen in the past, you don't get a lifetime warranty. And if something for whatever reason goes wrong with these headphones, I guess you just send them back to the company and they'll give you they'll give you a brand new pair, which is amazing to me and it shows me the confidence that they have in this product. Either they show me the confidence that they have in this product or they know that this product won't last and that they wanna keep a good relationship with their consumer base so they just offer this lifetime warranty. I really think that it's because they have the confidence in their product and not the latter, but I guess only time will tell. Also, we have an ambient mode. Now, the ambient mode, and I'll show you a little bit later, it's you use the multi-function button. You double-click that, and it uses, let me see right here, with just two clicks, a separate patented omnidirectional mic picks up external sounds and transmits them through your earphones, allowing you to hear your surroundings in real time without removing your earphones. I've tested this out and I, I will get into that a little bit later. That's pretty much it what's in, on the outside of the box. So let's open this up and see how they look. Oh yeah, real quick, before I get into all that, if this is your first time here, please feel free to smash that subscribe button and also please comment, like, share this video if you find anything in this video that is informational and you're, it's able to help you and you want to just show me some love. Also. These headphones come in three different colors. You got the white ones, which I got right here, black and red. And the pricing for these headphones, they range from anywhere from $66 to $74. I found them on Amazon for $66. And depending on what color you get on Amazon and on the Bleak website, um, depends on the price, but it ranges anywhere from $66 to $74. So. Now let's go ahead and dive inside this box and see exactly what these headphones look like. I got the white pair, and I guess the white pair sponsors Kelly O'Hare, US Women's National Soccer Team, world champion and gold medalist. There's a plastic film over top of it, and it is a little bit challenging to try and open this tab up. I, um, 
I actually almost cut this box open just to get these headphones out because I didn't think that I was doing it right. But anyways, you got the headphones on top. You have your instruction manuals, warranty card, and everything in here. Set that to the side. You have your ear tips, your carrying pouch, and your USB cable. Um, this and this carrying pouch, I mean, it's pretty nice. It's held together magnetically. They give you a bunch of different ear tips. You got your double flange and your single flange ear tips. Like I said before, the ear tips that normally come on these headphones, they fit my ears perfectly. So I very rarely do I have to switch these out to see what works best. So, um, but just it's nice that the company gives you this many options. Now, when I first saw these, I'm like, okay, they're a little bit bigger. They're meant just for working out. Um, but you can obviously walk around and use them on a, for uh, on a regular basis if you want to. But when I first got these headphones, and I put these headphones on. Let me go ahead and slide these in real quick. Now, when I first got these headphones and put these headphones on, what I was surprised about, extremely surprised about was the comfort of these headphones. These headphones sit nicely in your ears and I worked out with these. I did jump rope, I did a spin class, I went running with these. And it's a great way to stay in shape. And they don't move around in your ears. Uh, I mean, maybe a little bit if you sweat a lot, a little bit, just a tiny bit, but I sweat a lot and they don't move around your ears. They stay in your ears perfectly. And just for me, when I'm working out, if I'm already tired, I'm already, uh, my nerves are, I mean, if something bothers me, it just like intensifies it by, by 10. If something's bothering me while I'm working out. And when I'm working out and I have, I have to constantly take my earphones out, wipe them down and put them back in my ears so that they stop moving around or fall out or almost falling out, that just irritates me the most when I'm working out. But with these headphones, I didn't have to do that not one single time. And that's something that I look for when I'm shopping for headphones that I want to work out in is how good do they stay in my ears when I sweat because I do sweat a lot and they tend and some head some headphones tend to fall out of my ears but with these headphones they didn't fall out I applaud bleak for that so let me go around these headphones so at the top you got these silicone ear hooks and they're flimsy so that they could fit around anybody's ears really. On the left side is where you have your inline controller. Now your inline controller, and it's, it's, it's the same with most inline controllers. You got your volume up and volume down, which also doubles as your track forward and track back. And you have the multi-function button here in the middle. The multi-function button, it plays and pause music, ends and answer phone calls, and also if you hold it down for two seconds, it activates the ambient mode. Now, I spoke about the ambient mode earlier. It takes the microphone from the inline controller and it brings in the outside noise. Now, to me, if I just pause the music, I can hear my surroundings a lot better than if I use that feature. That feature to me, it just seems like a muffled echo. Bleak could really approve upon this this function right here it's not bad but it can be better and i guess that's something that they can work on on the next version of these headphones if they plan on coming out the next version but to me i'm not really sold on the ambient mode simply because it doesn't work it doesn't work as advertised in my opinion and then you also got your charging port right here on the side like i said it is usb mini i don't know how long it takes for a full charge but when you do charge it up full, it's about 14 and a half hours. Maybe that's in the user manual. And then going down the cord, you also have this little device right here. I believe this, I don't know what it's called. It has a nice, has a nice little bleak logo on it, but it's, it's like a, it's a tensioner. It, it's used to tighten or loosen if you wear it behind your neck, the cord behind your neck or in front of your neck. It's used to tighten the slack on there. Um, that is a good touch so you don't have the cord bouncing around, flopping around when you're um, working out with these headphones sound quality is not bad at all to be honest with you you're not going to get a tremendous amount of bass yeah you'll get some bass but you're not going to get a tremendous amount of bass with these headphones but the sound quality is decent like i said before in my other videos i'm not an audiophile 
It's loud, it's clear, it's crisp, and that's what I'm looking for when I'm working out. I, I wear these for maybe an hour, an hour and a half max, and then I'm done with them for the day, set them to the side, and and that's good enough for me. I don't know if that's good for you, but that's good enough for me. I just use these headphones to work out, and the sound quality in these headphones are good enough for that. Now, you're not gonna, I mean, they're not, obviously, obviously they're not comparable to some over-the-ear Bose, Sony, Sennheiser headphones with uh, with um, noise canceling and, and all of that jazz, but for, for working out, for running, for jump roping, these headphones um, get the job done. And that's pretty much it for these earphones. These earphones are a very good product for working out. If you want to work out, you're looking for some headphones, something that is um, very cheaply priced. Like I said before, it's anywhere between $66 and $74, depending on where you get them. I have no complaints about it besides the ambient mode feature, but other than that, I think that, that I think that Bleak did an amazing job with these headphones and I can't wait to see what the next version of these headphones look like if they improved upon the ambient mode and whatnot. Yeah, that's all I gotta say about these headphones, man. As always, if this is your first time here, please smash that subscribe button. If you found anything in this video that helped you out, helped you make a decision on your next workout headphones, please like this video, comment, share, do whatever you gotta do. Show some love in any way you can. My name is Nicholas, and this is the Tech Love Channel. I'm out. Peace.